Watch this video now if you're looking how to create grid feed emails using ClickFunnels autoresponder because you too want to use SendGrid's free service, right? Okay then, keep watching this video until the end because the solution is coming up. Well guys, this is the final step of the third step series I created for you. So you can create a drip feed email sequence in your autoresponder in ClickFunnels. As you can see, this is a very short video, so just follow me and be ready to send emails to the people who opt in in all of your funnels. What you need to do first is go to the Cloudflare dashboard and if you're using the domain name exclusively with ClickFunnels, you have to see only these four records. If you are using a domain name for ClickFunnels and also for a blog or a website, you have to see more than four records, okay? If you skipped videos one and two of this training series, let me tell you that you need to have a SendGrid account and you also need to configure all the settings in your ClickFunnels account prior to following these steps on this video. So the first thing you need to do is go to the ClickFunnels dashboard and get into one of your funnels. Click the edit page button, then click on the automation tab. Now click the add new email button so you can create the first email in the drip feed sequence. And of course, as many emails as you want in the from name box, type the name you want the people to see. In my case, I'm putting my own name. In the second box, put the email subject. In this first email, the condition is for everyone because you want everybody to see your emails, right? And then on the HTML box, you need to put the message you want to deliver to your audience or people who opted into your email list. The final step is you need to click the email delay tab. You put zero if you want people to see your email right away. And I mean, as soon as they type in their name and email address in your funnels landing page. If you want people to receive your first email right away, but within a few hours, you need to put the how many hours in the delay hours box. Finally, click the create email button. And as you can see, you have your first email ready to go. Talk soon. Bye.